Hello everyone, this is the CS Revelation. Welcome to a new video. Today I'm going to show you how to use the order by. So in our database here, we have certain rows that are inserted in specific order. But if we're trying to view this data uh, or select some rows out of these uh, tables, uh, and if we wanted to list them in a specific order, then we can actually do that uh, by adding the order by clause to the uh, select statement. Now, let's see if we were just to select uh, everything from the city table without ordering anything, right? So we just want the order in which or your database management system is viewing the data. So this is the order in which uh, they are listed. And say that uh, I would like to order these or sort them by area code, right? So the smallest first, uh, then the highest. So I'm going to sort them by, so I'm going to add the order by, and then I'm going to mention the column uh, name that I'm going to order by. So it's area code and I'm ordering in ascending order. So I'm adding the ASC keyword here in front of, uh, uh, after the column that I'm ordering by just to say that I'm ordering all these rows by this column in ascending order. So let's see the outcome of this. Now when we run that, notice now the rows are ordered differently. Notice that 30 comes first, then 212, then 213, and so on, and 574 is last. That is because it's ascending order. If you wanted the order to be in descending order, then instead of ASC, you type DESC, right, which stands for descending order. And when you run this, notice now uh, the rows are ordered differently based on order code, uh, area code in descending order. Now, it is also possible to order by multiple columns at the same time. So let's suppose that we want to order by country ID, first of all. So say we want to order by country ID, descending or ascending, it's up to you. By the way, if you don't put ascending or descending, by default is going to order in ascending order. So this is the ascending order of country ID, right? One, two, three, four, five. But notice we have two rows here, New York and Los Angeles, that are listed uh, in two. Uh, so we have New York listed before Los Angeles, even though we have a tie, which is the country ID. So in this case, the ordering by multiple columns comes handy. Say that we're ordering in ascending order by country ID. And we, if we have a tie, if we have a tie in the country ID values, then let's order by this column, which is, let's say, city name, uh, city name in, let's say, ascending also order, okay? So now what happens here is that, notice, we have New York, then Los Angeles. Let's see what happens when we run this. Now we have Los Angeles and then New York. And that is because, uh, first... Uh, we ordered by where we sorted all the values by country ID, but then when we have a tie, we move to the next column by which we are ordering, and that is city name. And in this case, Los Angeles and New York alphabetically in ascending order because L comes before N, and that's why Los Angeles is listed first. So this is a quick overview of the order by. Uh, and in the next video, I'm going to show you how to use the group by clause. Okay, so till the next one, stay tuned.